Like, how's everybody doing today? Hopefully everybody ha is having a good day today. Hopefully, you know, there's no problems, you know. Hopefully your family's good and everything, but look. What I want to talk about is Facebook or, you know, people in general, you know, why the fuck? Every time I try to look for a fucking relationship or fucking want to do something with, uh, with, you know, try to, you know, get in a relationship, people always try to say, oh, I'm not your type, boy, you know, I'm not, you know, I ain't looking for a relationship. What I do? Like, this one time, I was trying to tell, you know, I was trying to look for a relationship. And the first thing that this chick fucking takes me out there, I said, I'm looking for a fucking serious relationship that will lead to marriage. She fucking put, oh, I'm not your type, you know, and stuff like that. How the fuck do you know what my type is? If you say that, um, that you're not my type and that, and stuff like that, what the fuck? Basically, that's what she said. She said that I was the type and shit, or the, you know, sort of that, per se. <clears throat> you know, how the hell do you know what my type is if you know me so much, or if you, if, as soon as I said it, oh, wait, I forgot you. So you probably gonna go out with a fuckboy or somebody that, you know, pretty much I ain't gonna do shit with this life, so this is what this. But anyway, man, I just got a call, fucking motherfucker, <clears throat> from the motherfucking hospital. I tried to tell this lady on the other line that fucking I can take a message and have her. You know, take a message for, you know, my grandma and shit and have her call. Then when she got back and this motherfucking, this, uh, this fucking stupid ass lady or whoever, this girl or whoever fucking just hung up on me. Really, motherfucker? And you try to say, oh, um, can you talk to her on her behalf and shit? Um, no, I can take a message. But as soon as they did that, why the fuck did you hang up? Why did you hang up? I told you I could take a fucking message and have her call you when she is back. And your stupid ass just fucking hung up the phone like, really? Why the fuck are you even calling her? I told you she's not here right now. I can take a message. I can have her call you when she got back. But no, you fucking hung up the fucking phone, so I, as of right now, I'm kind of fucking pissed off, so hopefully people from the fucking hospital or the pharmacy or wherever the hell you call them, don't fucking call back until either you're about to fucking close or, you know, some, well, probably really can't do, you probably can't call back tomorrow. Because, um, for you, you know, be busy tomorrow, and no one's probably gonna be here, but, you know, that's what it is, you know, straight up. <clears throat> um, but, uh, anyway, back to all this other shit, you know, people are real shady on fucking Facebook every time you trying to, you know, and that's why I have basically a lot of friends, you know, I just fucking tripped out on, you know, <clears throat> this one, you know, one time, dude, one of my friends I used to go to elementary school with, and, you know, middle school and shit, you know, said to my friend, because I didn't really fucking know her, I couldn't really remember her until she told me who that, you know, who she was, and, um, now hopefully, you know, but yeah, right now, I ain't ready to say what state she's in or where she's specifically at. But uh, hopefully you have a, you know, a good life, you know. Hopefully, you know, everything works out. Hopefully, you, <clears throat> you know, you find work soon and shit. You know, and I wish you all the best, you know, straight up. You know, um, but, <clears throat> you know. <clears throat> 
but oh yeah, back to the other thing. Half of you motherfuckers inside. That's why I don't really want to fuck with get a girlfriend inside because all you motherfuckers think the same. Everybody try to say, oh, you know, I'm this or I'm that. Yeah, you're probably this and that, and people don't know you, but when people fucking do actually know you, and that's actually quite opposite, not unless you're gonna, you know, not unless they do you dirty or do you wrong or do something to, you know, piss you off or basically, like, you know, I don't know. Everybody tries to put respect in the name for what. Who the fuck are you? No, you know, why would somebody else put respect when saying somebody's name when they don't even fucking know you or this and that? A lot of these other motherfuckers on Facebook, especially all the chicks, man, they got like a lot of things say, you know, you're, you know, you why more to your own opinion and. You know, stuff like that, you know, but I just don't like, you know, people that put fucking, or chicks that put fucking single on their motherfucking profile. Every time I try to fucking be looking for a fucking, neither a motherfucking relationship, they always want to be friends. What's up with that? Oh, yeah, back to the topic, but. The uh, fuck boys, basically. All you motherfuckers, all you chicks in the sack will probably rather go out with a fuck boy that ain't gonna do shit with his life. You know, motherfuckers that try to say, oh, I wanna get the fuck out of the sack. You know, no, you go out with a fuck boy, you're gonna be stuck in the sack all your fucking life till they put you in the ground to be real with you. <clears throat> or people that fucking. You know, people that don't have, you know, that's just going to drag you down and you are not going to fucking be nothing if you let people drag you down and talk negative about you and, you know, certain stuff, you know, take it from me. I had a lot of fucking fuck-ups and, you know, I had a lot of bad experiences with, like, online dating and shit, you know. But this what this, you know, I met some wonderful people. I uh, met, you know, people that I probably wouldn't even fucking, if, you know, I never would have met <clears throat> couple people from different states, you know, some of my friends that I don't fucking keep in contact with, which I should, but, you know, people, I met people from Florida, fucking, you know, people from fucking be you know, Florida, Mexico, fucking anywhere you think of I know I knew people from Manchester, England, from fucking Africa, fucking Nigeria, fucking motherfuckers, you know, that a normal motherfucker, you know. And the, I all I gotta say is this, man, if you got a Facebook, you know, at least Go outside your comfort zone, you know, meet new people or fucking stop fucking, you know, stop just basically just accepting people you know or that you fuck with basically because I, you know, they're, they're just going to talk about the same old shit. You know, that's what really bugs me. Why the fuck are you even trying to accept people fucking, you know, accept just your homies for your request, man. Just talk about stupid shit, you know. Shit that you did fucking three, maybe four or five years ago. With your stupid asses. You know, and hopefully everybody, you know, everybody find, you know, looks at the big picture and find something better, you know, than what situation they're in. Do you find something better, you know, at least meet new people or get the fuck out of them. You know, get out of the situation, you know, have time for yourself. You know, have, you know, you know, have time for yourselves or, you know, basically everything that, 
You know, like you want to do this, you can't do it. But I just don't, you know, just don't put yourself around negative people or people who are going to drag you down and bring you down and say, oh, you ain't going to do this or you can't do that. Or, How are you going to do this when you don't have no money or how are you going to do certain stuff or certain things if you're not working and you ain't getting you know, a paycheck every two weeks? <sighs> just stay positive, you know. I was just trying to, you know, get that on my chest. Some people on Facebook are crazy, man. I only met, like, maybe what, one person on Facebook, you know. I was, you know, trying to be in a relationship for, like, uh, three months. All for Facebook, and I don't even really do that shit, to be real. You know, but I'm actually single right now, and, you know, and stuff like that, you know, I just, I just really don't like being single no more. That's why I was trying to find a fucking relationship, but somebody wanted to have try to act like you should Some people act like they don't need somebody to try to fucking find somebody that they actually want to fucking be with, which is either a fuckboy or somebody that's not going to do it, you know, that really ain't going to fucking do shit, but fucking stay in Arizona or stay in fucking Saturday or wherever the hell that they're from, which is stupid because half of you motherfuckers won't give an example. Everybody says, oh, I'm going to do this, or I want to go to Las Vegas, you know, I want to fucking see, you know, something, you know, go to different places to see new people and, you know, do this and do that. You ain't going to be able to do that if you be fucking, if you're going out with this dude or this fuck boy or, you know, or, this, or somebody that is basically going to keep you down and keep you here. You know, you ain't gonna accomplish nothing like that, you know. You know, I met people with business minds. I met people with, you know, people that, you know, that know what they want and talk about business, you know. I had business deals before I even fucking did me another Facebook because my other one, some, or I, my other one got hacked, someone changed my fucking password and I fucking signed me out of messenger to be real. And so anyway, um, yeah. You know, anyway, um fucking people like, you know, have these chicks in sack because I don't know uh, and or Santan or upper Santan or lower Santan, you know. I want to be talking big shit, but they ain't going to do shit, you know. I see this shit every time. Everybody says, oh, I ain't going to be like this person. Or I ain't going to be a fucking drunk like that person, you know. But, you know, I see it every time. Every time somebody says, I ain't going to be like that person. Or I ain't going to be like, you know, my family members be drunk on my ass or fucking high or something. Of that matter, it's the same cycle over and over. It just repeats itself. Why? Uh, dude, you know what? All you people in Sacramento, Arizona, or if you live somewhere in Arizona, can do something with your life because you're still fucking young enough to, you know, fucking get money, you know, help your family out or help a homeless person out that's less fortunate than you that don't have nothing or don't know when their next meal's gonna come. You know, you know, my sister always tells me that be fortunate of what you have. And I forgot how the saying goes because I'm just real so, I'm just kind of pissed right now. So basically, check this shit out. So, everybody that's in the fucking comments said, oh, I do this or I do that. You know, I made money. That's cool. Get your money. 
but half the other motherfuckers that be on Facebook posting stupid shit, be posting stupid shit trying to say I get money or, you know, or I don't need a man or some bullshit. No, you, you just don't want, you don't want them. A motherfucker with a business mind, you just want to go out with these fuck boys and a bunch of other people that are just going to keep you down because, you know, I'd rather have a business mind to be a fuck boy or, you know, to be somebody that, you know, that doesn't have a mind for business or, you know, that ain't going to really do shit with the with the life, you know, and just sit there. I'm trying to, you know, yeah, all I'm trying to say is let me find a fucking, uh, let me find a girlfriend first and I'll like, probably, <clears throat> let me find a girlfriend first and I'll take it from there, you know, if, uh, that sh- if this shit was not meant for me to fucking have a girlfriend, you know, I mean, I understand that. I guess I keep on pushing, keep on fucking, I can't, I'm mean, gonna keep doing my thing and shit, and you know, hopefully, you know, one of these days, you know, I run, in, I run into the right woman, and, you know, I really, uh, I, man, I'm, pfft, run into the right woman instead of somebody that says, Oh, you're not my type. And then I try to say, oh, can we be friends? And I say, oh, I guess. I guess. Like, what the fuck? Really? Then you try to say you smoke weed. I used to smoke weed. But if you want to get down with me, for real 100, dude, get, get, get some motherfucking weed from the dispensary. Because honestly, you guys are still smoking this bullshit. I'ma tell you, anybody that smokes weed, man, dude, if y'all smoking motherfucking weed, I get down the street or somewhere, you know, and a motherfucker still has that bullshit ass weed that you has been smoking for pretty much all your life, go get, have somebody with a motherfucking, you know, a marijuana card or something, <laughs> something, to go get a dispensary, dude, the dispensary, the, Weed that they have at a dispensary, yeah, it tastes a difference. And honestly, I can tell you this. Real, man, you ain't gonna go back to that fucking bullshit, dirty ass, nasty ass weed. And that bullshit, dirty ass, nasty ass weed that y'all be smoking from down the street that your homeboy gets from. Wherever the, uh, that your homies get from, wherever the hell they get it from. Get some dispensary weed, you know, I don't know, fuck, get some weed from the dispensary, you know, smoke that, I taste that shit, dude. Taste it, at least, dude. That's all, it's all I'm asking. You can just tell different right on the back. You know, I don't really smoke weed. I only smoke weed maybe like what? One time, you know, I didn't taste the difference of the weed that all these, you know, you ain't pop get down the street and from a motherfucking dispensary, dude. <clears throat> so anyway, you know, I just want to talk about, you know, got a lot of shit on my chest like that. People are just bullshitting and try to say that, oh, you know, I'm your type. How the fuck do you know what my type is? Can you read my mind or can you fucking know what my type is? Uh, I told everybody my type, mother, man. See, that's, and all you other motherfuckers that try to act like you fucking Mexican, or that you fucking Latino and fucking try to dress like y'all fucking this and that. Stop. Please, can you guys please stop that? That's 2019, dude. I fucking see happy for a shot dress like y'all fucking. Like you still dress back when you're in fucking high school, dude. Just leave that. 
Dude, just leave it alone, bro. Leave that shit alone. Dude, you're already old. I'm just gonna say, I try to change up my style, dude. I don't really give a fuck. I can wear fucking shorts or I can wear fucking. You know, I know, man, dude. All you other motherfuckers that try to say you Mexicans. No, that I try to say that he speaks Spanish. I know a little bit of Spanish, but I ain't really gonna fucking, you know, I ain't really gonna talk about that. I ain't really gonna, you know, try to speak in Spanish. Cause I, you know, a little bit, I'm probably like the only Mexican, you well, know, I have Mexican in my family that don't know how to speak Spanish, but that's cool, man. That's cool. Anyway, hopefully everyone's having a good day today, and hopefully everybody has a wonderful or a wonderful day, a good day, and a wonderful night night. Oh yeah, another thing, dude, just a, just um, just another thing. Oh boy, I kind of need to talk to you about something. You know, we need to catch up to be real with you. We basically need to catch up, man. That's all I'm saying. Oh, well, I can say that other thing, but I don't know, man. But we need to catch up, man. We need to conversate, you know, link up. If you ever come back down to Arizona, to be real, you know, link up, you know, or we just chop it up by messenger, you know. You know, I'm happy that you're doing good for yourself, you know, and keep, you know, keep grinding, keep doing what you've been doing, you know, at least somebody had the common sense to get the fuck out of Arizona, straight up, man, oh yeah, and other things, man, hopefully everybody has a wonderful day, and all you girls and all you women on Facebook, stop bullshit, stop lying to yourself. You know, stop, you know, trying to say that you don't need a man, but then you fucking turn around and go out of fuck, boy. You just stop that. You get with the motherfucker, and that's going to be positive. That That's going to help, basically help you in life. And, uh, that's all I'm going to say. Oh, yeah. Um, I hope everybody has a wonderful day and a wonderful night. All right, wonderful day. Um. Uh, uh, even a greater, even a greater fucking night tonight. Uh, oh, boy, everybody's, all, all everybody's dreams come true, you know. Oh, so I say, Lord, you need to hit me up, man. I need to, you know, we need to catch up on some things, man. Peace, I'm out. <laughs>